What's up, y'all? It is uh, Mike, the movie guy of iWatchMike.com. I checked out another movie. Mila Kunis, Mark Wahlberg, Seth MacFarlane, and Ted Unrated. <laughs> I've taken Lauren to dinner. You don't think she's going to be expecting something big, do you? It's been four years, Johnny. You and me have been together for 27 years. Where's my ring? Huh? Where's my ring? What did all my fuzzy fingers? Where's my ring? ring? Hey, Come on. Knock it off. All right, I'm just saying. There you have it, y'all. Ted actually hit stores uh, this past Tuesday. I got my hands on this uh, Blu-ray DVD digital ultraviolet. Watch it anywhere, anytime copy. As you can see right here, this is the box. You slide it out. A towel. Um, it's just like any other Blu-ray cover. Uh, you open it up, and it's got my little code there. You can't see that because I don't want you digital, uh, downloading my digital code. Uh, you get some free stuff from Ted, and bam, nothing really fancy inside. TVD Blu-ray. If you don't know what this movie's about, I don't know where you've been because Ted has been everywhere. Let me tell you about the movie. Mark Wahlberg stars in this movie. He is the main guy, uh, the main guy that his friend is Ted, a stuffed animal. Uh, as a kid, he's picked on and um, makes a wish on Christmas. Um, I think it was Christmas. I believe it was Christmas, yeah. And makes a wish that he wishes his teddy bear was alive so he could be best friends forever, which comes true. And uh, once that happens, um, it pretty much, it was kind of cool because when I first started watching the movie, I was wondering how they were going to like incorporate this living bear in society. But it's cool because once the movie starts, you see how Mark Wahlberg gets a girlfriend. Mark Wahlberg is friends with Ted and Ted. So basically Ted becomes this phenomena of Christmas miracle and pretty much everybody accepts them uh, as a uh, living thing. It's not a surprise, it's not scary or anything like that. So uh, I liked how they did that because I was wondering how they incorporate a living bear in this movie. Uh, Seth MacFarlane uh, plays the voice uh, of uh, Ted. If you are a fan of Family Guy, uh, you know what I'm talking about. Mila Kunis is in this movie as well. She is hot, uh, like always. Um, and so basically, um, Mark Wahlberg grows up and it gets to the point where Ted is just a little bit, bit of unbearable. He uh, he pretty much um, is kind of like that little that, that splinter between um, the relationship of Mark Wahlberg and Mila Kunis. And uh, he pretty much just follow what goes on with their life. And then finally, Ted is uh, asked to kind of move out of the apartment so Mark Wahlberg and Mila Kunis can start their life. Was it a good movie? Yeah, it's a good movie. I wish I really would have saw this movie in the theater because to be honest with you, coming from the theater and then leading up to the DVD release, I had seen all of the, the, the funny takes, the, the everything. So when I was watching the movie, I was like, uh, okay, that's funny. Oh, yeah, yeah, I saw that about 10 times already. So I kind of kicked myself in the butt because I think I really would have enjoy, enjoyed this movie more if I would have saw it the first time when everybody else saw it at the screen. I don't think I met one person that didn't like this movie. Um, uh, my friends really, really enjoyed this movie. Um, uh, and me, eh, my girlfriend, who is a fan of Family Guy, believe it or not, after we watched it, I asked her, I was like, so what'd you think? And she was like, oh, I, I think it was okay. Some of the parts were kind of stupid, which was kind of funny because I was like, well, that's how I feel about Family Guy. I know some of y'all out there are like, what, don't you talk about Family Guy? I've never watched an episode of Family Guy. I like Stewie, I like the dog. I just don't uh, care too much for that kind of throw in kind of comedy and you're like, what, where did that come from? There's a certain breed of people that get that. I'm not a fan of it. Um, so I was kind of surprised my girlfriend didn't like this movie as much as I did. Joe McHale from The, uh, from the Soup is in this movie. He plays a pretty cool, funny douchebag in this. Uh, but it's got a really good cast. If you're a fan of any of this here, right here, then you should scoop it up because it's perfect stocking stuff for, for uh, the fans of Family Guy and all these people right here. And if you like alcohol and drugs, bam, this is even Flash Gordon. If you're a fan of Flash Gordon, that was kind of cool seeing Flash Gordon in this. And some of y'all have no idea what I'm talking about, but it was one of the greatest movies ever made. Yeah, I'm that old. How many popcorns do I give Ted? I would probably give it uh, three and a half out of five popcorns. Three and a half out of five popcorns. It's funny, it's worth checking out, and it's a perfect stocking stuffer. Don't forget to check out my blog, iWatchMike.com, and if you're on Twitter, follow me on Twitter at MikeTheMovieGuy. Peace.